Cambry Michelle, TJ Stokes, big for Lennox tonight and a season opening win over Clorinda. Ladies, you guys start the year 1 and 0. What does that mean? I think it was a big improvement from last year for sure. We made a lot of growth already. Yeah, what were some of the things you feel like you guys did really well tonight? Uh, talking and passing the ball and putting our shots up. I think we were, did a really good job of playing fast. That hasn't really been something we've done in the past, and we pushed it really well, and we pressured a lot harder on our press, and it worked a lot. Camber, you did a really good job of kind of being able to muscle your way down low. I think I had you for 18 points, 12 boards. Uh, what were you doing so well down there? Uh, listening to the girls to tell me where to go and uh, being tall. <laughs> <laughs> that always helps. Uh, how do you try to use your size to your advantage? Uh, keep my arms up and try to space out so I can get more area to work with. TJ, talk about your night, a little bit of everything. I think 18 points, six boards, handful of steals. So what were you seeing? Um, well, first of all, it's kind of just good to be back playing kind of a little rusty, but um, I, we were, they were playing man a couple times, and it was good for me to get down low, post up my girl, and get under the basket. Um, I think I really used that to my advantage, and then on the press, we, like I said, we pushed really hard, and I got a few steals off of that. Which you mentioned you guys played fast. Uh, it certainly looked like it. You guys ran nine deep. Uh, what's that been like trying to get your, you guys in a situation where you can do that? We've done a lot more conditioning this year than we have in the past, and we've really been pushing hard in practice, and I, I think it's really benefited us. 1-0, you guys look pretty darn impressive as well. Uh, how do you guys try to build off this going forward? Uh, we will try to look at our mistakes and try to fix try not to get as many turnovers as we did for our first game. Yeah, I think we need to clean up our turnovers a little bit and just keep pushing, keep working. There's always room to be made. Mm -hmm. Coach, uh, that was a, what I think is going to be a much improved Clorinda team that you guys took care of tonight. Looked pretty impressive in the process. Just your thoughts? Yeah, uh, that, that Clorinda team is a lot better. They played really good defense. Uh, we were not able to just run the offense and pass it around. They forced us to do some stuff that we really haven't practiced yet, you know, penetrating and kicking and stuff like that. So they're much improved. And uh, the first half, they really hit a lot of mid-range, you know, 16, 15-footers. So we had to make some adjustments there. Uh, but we were able to, to get some easy buckets and hit some threes late. And uh, our, our defense did a fairly good job tonight. TJ talked about you guys being able to play fast. It certainly certainly looked like it. Is that something that you guys kind of want to be an emphasis of yours this year is to be able to be up-tempo? Yeah, uh, you know, not losing any seniors, so everybody's just a year older, uh, a little bit faster. Some of them are a little bit taller. And with having Tyra back, uh, she's full strength. Uh, McKenna Hogan, obviously, uh, she's faster than she was last year. You know, you can tell that by her performance in cross country and the, the work she did in the offseason, just quickness and agility drills for cross country has paid off now. Brooklyn Eklund is fast, you know. Uh, so, you know, we're not really tall. Cambry's got some height on her and Janessa and Jordan, but, you know, they're not six footers, you know. So we got to use our speed. You mentioned Cambry. Uh, how big is it to have someone down there that can just kind of bully their way like she did tonight? Well, best thing about coach, uh, coaching her, she's very coachable, and she does all the little drills and practice that, that makes her uh, good in the game down by the basket. And the other thing is she knows her role, and uh, she, she loves basketball. She loves this team, and so she just plays her heart out for us. Defensively, you guys played fast as well. Uh, what did you like uh, in that end? Um, we were able to switch up defenses a lot, and the most impressive part any coach will say is uh, the communication the girls had. Uh, no matter what, what we switched up in, they talked to each other and found their spots, and that's probably the thing I was most impressed with tonight. Want to know, how do you guys try to build off this? Well, uh, we're going to practice a lot. We'll practice tomorrow, take Thanksgiving off, and then back in the gym uh, Friday, Saturday, try and get better, and uh, you know, hopefully the season continues.